Hello everyone, Nick is from Street Pass Princeton here, and this is some footage that was recorded from the Mario Golf World Tour tournament that was on May 18th. I wanted to make sure I could actually have some, um, some narration. So, anyway, this is Chris, he's playing as Peach. I give him a little guidance on how to shoot properly. So he does a pretty good shot. This is pretty much a perfect shot in the beginning. Does alright. So, here we go with the second shot. Um, he's obviously trying to look at the wind for the shot, so... He's he obviously knows that the ball is probably pointed to the right, but he might not be aware of that. I tried to point it out to him, even though I probably shouldn't have. I was like, just make sure you aim your ball slightly to the left, because that wind is going to curve it slightly to the right. Because watch what's happening. That ball, that, yeah, see? It's moving right to the right. And he did all right, and he got pretty close to the pin, too, so that'll be an easy putt for birdie. So, let's watch him go for birdie. He can pretty much putt this straight in. Okay. And he missed it because he did not hit hard enough. And I explained to him that you need to go past the recommended distance. And he gets par, luckily. I thought that his second shot was even weaker, and that he was going to whiff uh, a par shot, which would have been embarrassing. But luckily he gets par, so that's good. So we go on to the second hole, par 4. This one's fairly easy. He does an okay job. I tried to show them, I tried to show Chris, Sarah, and Matt how to do, like, top spins and back spins, but it kind of went over their head, so they weren't going to really do that. But here's Chris with Peach doing a decent shot. Aim for the hole right now. I think I might have told him go a little to the left because the ball is, is pointing win for the right. I told him to use a power shot so that way he could hit it closer to the hole. He probably didn't need to hit it all the way because if it did, it would roll past the uh, hole. So we'll find out what happens. Uh, that'll actually land him in the bunker, and I was almost going to warn him that, but I forgot to tell him before he hit, and he ends up landing in the bunker. Yeah, so, I was trying to give him guidance, but I was trying to also not give him too much guidance, so it's kind of a tricky thing, because it is a tournament, and I want to make sure that everyone wins, but it's hard when people don't really know how to play the game, and you're trying to give as much direction as possible without really spoiling it, so, yeah, maybe next time it won't be as bad, but he'll get par, this is not too bad. Nice par. So, par on the second hole, there's only three holes, we decided to just keep it short, so he's gonna go for the next hole, hole three, which is a par three, pretty simple, straight to the, the pin. So I'm warning him about the wind, just letting him know, you know, dude, that wind is going to blow ferociously bad. Just be careful. Don't hit it too hard. And it's already blowing pretty bad. He might have needed to aim it a little more to the left. But that's not too bad, because he seems to get it decently close. Not too close, but decently close. So he could probably put this straight in. I explained to him, dude, just go a little bit past the guideline that they tell you, and you'll get it in better and he does that and he gets Yay! it in so that's pretty much it he gets minus one so we'll be back with the next performance from matt so be sure to like this video leave a comment below and do not forget to subscribe check out our other events on facebook google plus and twitter such as animal crossing new leaf and mario kart 8 and i will see you guys soon see you guys very soon bye <laughs>